Hello everyone, meteorologist Raquel Dominguez here on this Friday. We have finally made it to the end of the work week and it's a nice start to the day so far. This is our live look at Scottsville. Not much traffic going on right now. We're right at 58 degrees. Winds are calm feels like we're right at 58 as well. Showers are currently pushing east of I-65, allowing us to turn dry for the rest of our morning and our afternoon ahead. We did see beneficial amounts of rainfall, though. Those along and east of I-65 saw the greatest amounts there. 0.3 inches were seen in Beaver Dam, almost an inch in Litchfield, almost an inch and a half in Scottsville about half of an inch here in town. Temperatures across the region feeling nice and comfortable. We're in the 50s right now, right around 58 here in Bowling Green, 53 in E-Town, still seeing some of those mid 50s, especially to our west across parts of Madisonville and Owensboro. Nonetheless, we're very similar to what we woke up to yesterday. Not too chilly, not too mild. And to the next several hours, I do think we're going to see lots of sunshine on tap for us. Perfect for those folks wanting to head on out, celebrate any Friday plans. Highs near 68 for today with calm conditions expected throughout tonight as well. Temperatures will drop to the 40s for our overnight lows. Temperatures get warmer into the next day or so, and then we get cooler for Sunday. But nonetheless, we are tracking bright, sunny skies today into Saturday and Sunday as well, which is why we're given that green light for our Fast Freddy's car wash forecast. And overall, it's going to be a really pleasant end to the work week. A uh, really pleasant weekend ahead and a really pleasant week ahead. Temperatures uh, flirting with the 60s today. Then we're at 74 for Saturday. We stay in the 60s for most of Sunday. We're nice and cool there. And then that warm up trend begins to set in next week. Those temperatures Monday morning will feature the upper 30s. So a chilly start to the week, but we don't continue on that chilly trend. In fact, we see a huge warm up there with highs near 70 degrees by Monday. Then we're in the mid to upper 70s Tuesday and Wednesday before we return to seasonable conditions as we head into the second half of the work week. A couple of stray showers cannot be ruled out by Thursday, but overall it will not be an all out wash out. As always, you can know the weather by downloading our WBKO First Alert weather app. This is where we post daily updates. You can just scan that QR code. It'll take you directly to our application.